Aam Aadmi Party has set a new record in the field of education in Delhi. The dream of studying abroad for 30 children in Delhi government schools has come true. These children have gone to Paris to do an advanced course in French language. This is the first time in India that 30 children studying in government schools have gone to Paris together to study French language. These children would have probably never thought that they would get such an opportunity, but the education revolution under the guidance of Arvind Kejriwal has done what people used to call impossible. Aap Supremo Arvind Kejriwal has posted on social media X congratulating the children who went to Paris. Kejriwal has written that 30 children from Delhi government schools are in Paris today to do an advanced course in French language. No one had ever thought that a child from a poor family studying in a government school would also go abroad to study. This is no less than a dream. Kejriwal further wrote that we are giving all those opportunity to every child of Delhi which till now were available only to children of big and rich families. Together with the people of Delhi, we will take this revolution to such heights that no one would have imagined. These children who went to Paris will learn about French language and French culture at Elions Francaise de Paris from November 4th to 15th. They will stay with host families, will also visit places like Eiffel Tower and Disneyland. Let us tell you that this program is run by the French embassy in India. The Delhi government has partnered with Alliance Française to teach French language with the help of French embassy in India. Under the program French language education has been added to its schools. This trip to Paris is a part of the immersion program of the Alliance Française. Most of the 30 children are first generation school goers. Anyway, this achievement of the Delhi government not only shows the process of Delhi in the field of education but also proves that everything is possible with the right direction and determination.